Well, I hate to say this because as a boxing fan, this is excellent news. But for Tim Zhu, goodness, your, your resume of, as of late is starting to look like a horror show. I mean, first, okay, Tony Harrison. That, that, that could have been a little iffy. Tony wasn't exactly looking like Tony his last couple fights. But far as a name, that's a former champion. Then you go and you, you get in there. You're supposed to fight Keith Thurman. But that doesn't happen. Instead, you take on probably a tougher task. Oh, hell no! By getting in there with the Tower Inferno. <laughs> that's, that, that's frightening enough as it is. And you wind up coming out of there with the horrific cut to boot. Then to make it worse, your next opponent is Virgil Ortiz. Oh my goodness. Your rap sheet is starting to, start to look pretty scary, man. One thing for sure, you can't say Tim Zoo is ducking anybody. He want all the smoke. And Virgil Ortiz will gladly oblige. Now, I'm going to be honest. This fight might be harder for Virgil Ortiz than Tim Zoo because it seems like Tim Zoo is more battle tested than Virgil Ortiz. But for Virgil Ortiz to get to Tim Zoo, he must first defeat an underdog in Tyler Delome on Saturday and emerge uninjured to get to this fight. Now, this fight is going to be held on the same card, a stacked card at that, as Crawford versus Israel Majamov. Now, and if you think that's, <laughs> that's not going to be exciting, I don't know what to tell you. Because Terrence Crawford, hey, you know how Bud get down. But this new Israel Majamov, he ain't no, he ain't no uh, body to be sleeping on. This guy comes with a lot of heat, a lot of power, flash power at that. This is going to be an exciting call. I can't wait for August to get here. And we got a lot of good fights between here and August. So, I just wanted to jump on here and put that out there. We got another banger on the schedule. Whew. It's going to be a hot summer, boy. This hell busting box is on Fight Dr. I am out.